Mr. Skill, come with me. Who's at the door? Hi. Hi, Jane. Hi, puppy. Are you ready to answer Bang's 57 questions? Yes, we're ready. Let's go. Do you like bubble baths? I do like bubble baths, actually, and I take one every single day. Wow. Do you like Twitch streaming? I do like Twitch streaming. I wonder how you knew that. I can just always tell. Yeah. What's your biggest career accomplishment? My biggest career accomplishment? Probably winning the ABNs that I've won. And I'm so accomplished about it that I like to just have them on display in the kitchen for everyone. And what's a career goal that you haven't accomplished yet? I think eventually I would like to be a full-time Twitch streamer and just focus all of my energy into that. What's your zodiac sign? I am a Libra on the cusp. What is your favorite typical Jewish food? My favorite typical Jewish food? Well, I don't know if I have any typical Jewish food in my fridge. It's mostly just a lot of meal planning and a salad and some liquid death and some film actually. Um, but my favorite is matzo ball soup. Mm. Netflix or YouTube? Definitely YouTube for the podcasts. East Coast or West Coast? I would say I was born on the East Coast, but I'm a West Coast girly now. Do you believe in luck or karma? I do. Both, actually. When have you been the most starstruck? Probably when I met my idol, Lana Del Rey, a few months back. Tell me more about that. How did it feel meeting Lana Del Rey? It felt crazy, honestly. It felt very surreal. Couldn't believe that it was happening as it was happening. I just saw her at a chili festival in Malibu. Um, and I just knew in the moment I had to say something. And I thought that I would like cry and freak out, but it just, it was kind of just a normal interaction. Amazing. Yeah. What color do you think you look best in? I think I look best in red. Ooh. Yeah. I see you have this awesome art on your wall. What's your favorite Tarantino movie? Well, if you couldn't tell from the art, my favorite is Pulp Fiction. Just checking. Yeah. Would you consider yourself an introvert or an extrovert? I think uh, in general I'm introverted, but when I feel comfortable with someone, I, I come out of my shell. What is the best type of pizza in the U.S.? I think New York pizza it has to be the winner. There's a reason that every other state in the country has famous New York pizza. They're all just trying to imitate the best. Of course. And what toppings do you put on your pizza? No toppings. If it's a really superior pizza, all it needs is cheese. No toppings necessary. Would you ever put pineapple on your pizza? No. It's going to be a no for me. <laughs> <laughs> what is your favorite type of workout? My favorite type of workout? Probably... Uh, I use resistance bands a lot on my arms and legs. What is one thing that you love about LA? One thing I love about LA is probably our beautiful weather that we have all year round. Who is your favorite ASM artist? My favorite ASM artist? Probably myself. <laughs> Do you travel light or are you an overpacker? So I would like to travel light, but I tend to be an overpacker because I'm just terrified of not having the things that I need being somewhere else. If you could meet one celebrity who was not Lana Del Rey, who would it be? <laughs> well, like since I crossed that off my bucket list already, I think probably Quentin Tarantino. Mm -hmm. I think it'd be cool to meet him. Hi. If you could go out dancing or out to a karaoke bar, which one would you choose? Definitely karaoke bar. I love to sing. What song would you sing? Oh my gosh, probably something by Lana Del Rey. I would need more time to think it over. I see. If you could travel to one place in the whole world, where would it be? Probably Italy right now. I see. Hey, Scout. Do you want to go for a walk? Does Scout want to go for a walk? I think he always wants to go for a walk. <laughs> well, let's go. Are you superstitious? <laughs> I don't think I'm superstitious. Not really. What's your favorite thing to read? My favorite thing to read? I used to read books. I used to read books, now I just read Wikipedia articles when I'm stoned. Is there a fictional character that you relate to? Um, a fictional character? Probably... Uh, honestly, I did not think these questions through. 
so no. <laughs> Are you usually on time, early, or late? I'm on time. I try to be on time or early. How would you describe the way your home is decorated? Like modern, retro, boho? It's definitely um, kind of retro. I really like all vintage retro vibes, like 70s. So anything like that, I try to include. What's your favorite restaurant in LA? Favorite restaurant in LA? Probably Avra Beverly Hills. What's your favorite restaurant in New York? Oh my God, my favorite restaurant in New York? I don't know if I have one. There's so many, it's so overwhelming. I just go wherever. What is the most attractive thing that a stranger can do? The most attractive thing a stranger can do is probably just uh, be polite and kind and not creepy. <laughs> what is something that you always keep in your purse? Always in my purse? Well, my keys, of course, but probably a lip gloss. What's your coffee shop order? Well, when I go to Starbucks, I always get the iced chai latte with oat milk. Had to think about it for a second. I just had it today. <laughs> what are three personality traits that you look for in a partner? Three personality traits? Well, loyalty, honesty, and a sense of humor, definitely. How would you spend your ideal Saturday? Ideal Saturday is waking up, walking Scout, and then just relaxing the whole day at home, smoking weed and watching TV. So imagine Elon Musk hits your line, would you go to space? Uh, no, because I like to live. What is your secret talent? My secret talent? Well, I've been telling people, so it's not very secretive anymore, but I can lick my elbow. Can you do it now? I think I could do it. I could muster up the ability. Because I'm wearing a bra, it might not be possible. <laughs> wow. <laughs> yeah. Even with the bra. Mm -hmm. What is your biggest fear? My biggest fear, probably death and dying and my family dying. <laughs> what is something that motivates you every day? What motivates me? Um, I don't know, just I guess my fear of failure. <laughs> what is your favorite flower? My favorite flower, I love a nice, pretty daisy and a rose, a white rose. Have you ever been stood up on a date? No, thankfully. Because who would stand you up? Look at you. Right, I don't really go on many dates, so it hasn't been an option. Are you very organized, forward thinking, or do you like to live minute to minute? I try to find a good balance of both, but it definitely tends to be on the minute to minute side, unfortunately. Would you ever wear Crocs? Uh, would I wear Crocs? Bam. Every damn day, baby. I'm a Crocs girl. Have you ever had a work crush? Yeah, definitely. In my industry, it's kind of hard sometimes to not have a crush on someone when you work with them a lot. If 18-year-old you saw you now, what is something that she would say? Um, probably be like, it's unreal that you're in the place that you are in your life and I'm so proud of you and I can't believe you've accomplished what you have. Are you creeped out by the idea of ghosts? Uh, yeah, definitely. I don't know if I believe in ghosts, but if I were to believe in them, I think that would freak me out a lot because it's a scary concept. What about aliens? Um, I don't know if I believe in aliens. I think there's definitely like life in other parts of the universe, but the freaky aliens that we know, I don't know if those are real. What's the most underrated fruit? Underrated fruit? I'm not a big fruit girl. I really only like watermelon and apples, which are kind of the most popular fruits. Um, I guess an underrated fruit, probably like a nectarine or something, like one of those little oranges. If this wasn't your career, what do you think you'd be working in right now? I couldn't tell you honestly because this is just how things played out, but I always wanted to be an actress. Who was your favorite Jonas brother? Oh my God, my favorite? Probably Joe. I love Joe. What is your dream date? Dream date? Probably have a really fun, nice dinner and go to a comedy show or a concert or something and then just hang out and spend a lot of time together. And lastly, what do you wear to bed? 
what do I wear to bed? Just a big shirt and usually no underwear or like a little pair of shorts or something. Thank you so much for answering our 57 questions, Jane. Thank and thank you. you for bringing Scout. Of course, Scout was happy to participate as well. Thanks for asking me. Bye. <laughs>